This video was made possible by Mizizi International, the official African diaspora clothing brand. Visit MiziziShop.com for more information. Egypt has officially initiated the construction of its inaugural nuclear power facility, El Daba, marking a significant milestone in the nation's energy development. The groundbreaking ceremony for Unit 4 saw the pouring of the first concrete for the foundation slab, signifying the official commencement of construction. Before we dive into our topic today, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channels and ringing the bell to be notified about all our exciting future videos. Attended by dignitaries such as Russia's President Vladimir Putin and Egypt's President Abdel Fattah el-Sisi, through a video conference, the El Daba nuclear station featuring four generation 3 plus VVER 1200 pressurized water reactors is hailed as the largest nuclear construction project on the African continent. The ambitious project aims to provide Egypt with safe, affordable, and sustainable energy, reducing reliance on fossil fuels and mitigating price fluctuations. The first unit is anticipated to come online in 2026, marking a crucial step towards enhancing Egypt's energy infrastructure. The El Daba nuclear power plant is set to be constructed in collaboration with Russia's state nuclear energy corporation, Rosatom, boasting four units situated west of Alexandria on Egypt's northern coast. El Daba has been highlighted by Rosatom as the most extensive nuclear construction endeavor on the African continent. During the ceremony on Tuesday, Alexei Likachev, Rosatom's Director General, emphasized the magnitude of the El Daba project, comparing it to the construction of the Aswan Dam as the most substantial collaboration between Russia and Egypt. He characterized the endeavor as a pivotal moment in the history of nuclear energy in Egypt and a significant development in Russia-Egyptian relations. President El Sisi, speaking at the ceremony, highlighted the project as a significant step forward in Russia and Egyptian relations. He pointed to the global energy crisis and supply chain challenges as key factors motivating the revival of Egypt's peaceful nuclear program, positioning El Daba as a crucial response to these issues. It contributes to providing safe, cheap, and sustainable energy that helps in reducing our dependency on fossil fuel and avoiding the fluctuation in its prices, he noted. Putin added that he maintains constant contact with Egyptian leader Abdel Fattah el-Sisi, emphasizing their ongoing exchange of opinions and coordination of stances, particularly concerning the strategic development in the Palestinian-Israeli conflict. We will contribute to the creation of modern industries, qualified jobs, and the solution of social issues. We will do this together since the new energy system allows us to do all these. This is truly a flagship project in the best traditions of our bilateral cooperations, Putin stated during the ceremony via video link. The continent's sole existing commercial nuclear power facility is a two-unit Quebec located near Cape Town, South Africa. Russia is providing four-generation 3-plus VVER-1200 pressurized water reactions for the El Daba nuclear power plant, with the first unit anticipated to be operational by 2026. In August, Egypt's regulatory body, the Egyptian Nuclear and Radiological Regulatory Authority, approved the construction of El Daba 4. The project's initial agreement, marking the country's first commercial nuclear station, was signed in 2015. Construction commenced for Unit 1 in July 2022, Unit 2 in November 2022, and Unit 3 in May 2023, according to the International Atomic Energy Agency. As Egypt's population and economy grow, the demand for electricity increases. The El Daba 4 power plant, once operational, will contribute to meeting this growing demand, preventing energy shortages and ensuring a stable power supply. The power plant will contribute to Egypt's energy security by diversifying its energy mix. Nuclear power provides a stable and continuous source of electricity, reducing dependence on fossil fuels and mitigating the impact of energy supply fluctuations. 
The reliable and sustainable electricity supply from the nuclear power plant will support economic development by ensuring a stable energy infrastructure. It can attract investment, spur industrial growth, and create job opportunities. Nuclear power is a low carbon energy source, and the El Daba 4 plant can help Egypt reduce its carbon footprint. This is particularly crucial in addressing environmental concerns and contributing to global efforts to combat climate change. The collaboration with Russians Rosatom for the El Daba project strengthens diplomatic and economic ties between Egypt and Russia. It showcases the ability of nations to collaborate on complex infrastructure projects for mutual benefit. Being home to Africa's largest nuclear construction project enhances Egypt's strategic position in the region. It demonstrates the country's commitment to technological advancement and positions it as a leader in the peaceful use of nuclear energy on the continent. As Egypt strives for energy security, economic growth and environmental sustainability, the power plant emerges as a pivotal solution. The strategic decision to embrace nuclear energy highlights Egypt's commitment to diversifying its energy sources. As the first commercial nuclear station in the country, El Daba marks a significant milestone, contributing to Egypt's long-term prosperity, technological advancement, and environmental stewardship. So what do you think of our video? What are your thoughts on this historic milestone by Egypt and its partnership with Russia to complete the El Daba nuclear plant? Let us know what you think in the comments below and as always, do subscribe to the new Africa channel for more exciting future videos.